1967, John Lennon walked into an antique shop and bought a Victorian circus poster that inspired him to write the song being for the benefit of Mr. Kite, for Sergeant Pepper. This is the clearest image we have of the print he bought that day. When it came to writing the song, Lennon said that the lyrics were staring him in the face and that he hardly made up a word. I'm a huge Beatles fan and I'd always wanted to have a copy of Lennon's poster on my wall, but with only poor reproductions available, I decided to recreate it myself from scratch. I could figure out the approximate size of the poster based on John Lennon's height. And by chance, one corner of the poster is visible in a colour photo, which confirmed that the poster was indeed black and white. The original illustrations were printed from wood engravings, and that's a rare skill, so I made contact with an artist who was more than capable of taking this on, Andy English. Wood engraving is a careful and precise process that hasn't changed in hundreds of years. Andy's work is breathtaking. Up close, you understand how much care has been taken with every single mark. After a great deal of research and discussion, we were able to strip away the noise to arrive at what we believe these engravings originally looked like. While Andy was working on the wood engravings, I tracked down a letterpress printer in London who had an incredible collection of Victorian wooden and metal type. Graham Bignall at New North Press. Graham's task was no mean feat. He had to match every typeface and every type size on the poster, while other parts had to be custom made. You can't rush something like this. Type is set letter by letter, line by line. We made dozens of proofs and hundreds of tiny adjustments to get it right. The poster gradually came to life, just like the original back in 1843. I had set out to recreate the poster that had inspired John Lennon. I had done it, with a little help from my friends.